We're in trouble. Oh, we're busted. Are you here for the group ride? Woo! Oh. Everybody ready to roll? What is up, YouTube? Are you guys ready to roll? Today we are out here with the group on Sir on Sunday. This is our first Sir on Sunday that we've done. And I'm pretty stoked about it. Usually you'll see all of our group rides are all PEVs included. We decided to do one just for the bikes, just because the bikes have been so adamant on showing up to all the other group rides. Um, haven't been active, nothing like that. And just been really wanting to ride with the bikes, but they still show up to every group ride, which, you know, you gotta show them love. People that put their time and effort and energy into this, I wanna, I wanna make sure to show them a good time. You know what I'm saying? So Sir on Sunday it is. We are gonna go get into some Sir on things. It looks like the trail might be a bit busy today though, so we're gonna have to work on avoiding these cyclists the best we can so that we're not going one wheel speed for a whole Sir on ride. So yesterday we had a really good ride. I attempted I started a video to film it and then I just had way too much fun to even think about filming any of it. So I didn't. I mean, that's, that's, that's enough said. But the homie Jackson came out. He's out here in Colorado visiting. So he came by for one of the rides. He's out here from Texas. One of the wheelie boys. He's actually the homie's wheel homie. Homies with the homie Will. So big shout out to Will and big shout out to Jackson. But Jackson came through yesterday and showed us some things on how to wheelie a bike. And it was the first time we've seen stuff like that in person here in Colorado Springs. We don't have stunners out here, guys. There's not a stunt scene out here. I mean, not for Surons at least. There's a little bit of a bike scene, like a stunt scene as far as Groms and stuff go. But Sir on Stunners, we do not have Sir on Stunners. It was incredible. It was super fun to see. It was a whole vibe to be around. And it just made me 10 times more amped for the Austin Mega Ride coming up. Which, as you guys know, I am riding my Sir on to that ride from Colorado Springs. 1,054 miles is what my trip is at right now. Miles keep getting added on, but I think that that is going to be the final unless something comes up during the trip or I have to make different route adjustments, anything like that. But as of right now, it's 1,054 miles is what we are planning for. Coming up on your left, there is six of us. Thank you. Thank you. Always be courteous when out riding your guys' trails. Um, I'm not telling anybody what to do, but I'm just saying this is how we kind of stay. Not under the radar, because it's hard to keep. No! I hit him! I ran it over! Bro! You know how they duck back in and out? Yeah. Bro, and if I slam all my brakes or try to do it, I'm gonna wreck and then wreck people behind me. Yeah, that was a total accident, dude. Don't let it get to you. We Good thing it's a Suron group ride. The one wheels would be pissed. <laughs> the Ultra B made that shit look like it was nothing, dog. Watch you guys mess up, I know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, good thing. I mean, seriously, good thing this is a Suron ride because this is washed out pretty bad. But this is always a really fun area to ride, so I wanted to make sure to take everybody through this. Show them all these little break-off trails. There's a bunch of break-off trails up here. 
I don't know if you guys remember the day. There was a video I made not too long ago where a guy was telling me that the rangers were going to come out and get me out here. But it's like there's no rangers out here because we're in the middle of the city. I'm not a ranger in sight. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. This is pretty good. I like riding out here. I think Chrissy is the only other one that's been out here with me before. Nobody else has came out here. It's fun though. It's this is some good riding out here. Um, it's a lot of dirt, a lot of a lot of different kind of shit that we don't usually ride on group rides. The thing with doing sur on group rides on trails is you don't want to be on too many mountain bike trails with this many big bikes um, just because shit could go way wrong way fast and that's not what we want okay so this is getting a bit crazy wifey's still back there holding it the fuck down though this got intense I did not mean for it to get like this. Oh, this is not everybody. I tell everybody we're going on a chill group ride and this is what the fuck I bring them on. Oh, I'm sorry, everybody. Oh, I'm very sorry, everybody. Oh, I'm so sorry, everybody. And if this is a dead end, I'm gonna be insanely sorry, everybody. I'm so sorry. I'm gonna make sure my wife's okay. I am so sorry, everybody. <laughs> All right, it's part of the fun. Oh, no, you're good. Bear back in here, rough country. Homie just got out of shoulder surgery. She just got stitches out of her knee. And I'm like, let's go on this hella tech shit, guys. <laughs> my bad. We're getting out of it. I hope we're getting out of it. You guys think we're getting out? Oh, we could have just found something really cool though. Whoa! What? This is tight. <laughs> yeah, this is. So, this is kind of what ends up happening on Sir on Sunday. Is we just find stuff like i said it's the first sir on sunday so anybody wants to come out to the next sir on sunday this is basically what you're looking at us doing we are just finding new routes for our surons to have fun and play on and it looks like this one was this one was halfway successful halfway not because We're now stuck in here. Vroom! Vroom, 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 vroom. What? Yeah, here they come. Get out of here. Who? That was that squirrel's cousin. He just like ran through This is pretty crazy though. Like, look at all these sweet jumps. Wait, at this point, I think we're just trying to find our way out, which looks like it's going to be this big road over here. Yo, I'll tell you what, though. These bikes put in work. I don't know how good this is coming through in video or how rough the terrain is, but it is not smooth, and everyone's killing it. That was pretty tight. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Real estate tour. Super worried about this storm that's coming in, everybody. You guys, don't you guys hate that? It'll be like great weather all week, and then when you want to go riding with the people, weather sucks. Bizzles. I said it. I said bizzles. So this ride today, I wouldn't even call it. This was a little bit more of an uh, advanced rider type ride just because of the situations we ended up in. Um, 
super, super pumped with how my wife is performing on her bike. This woman just got her stitches out like two days ago. She still has a torn meniscus. Um, she's super sore and she's riding stuff like this with a huge smile on her face. Um, it's so admirable. I say it in a lot of my videos, but my wife truly is one of my biggest inspirations in my life. Um, she's just a super, super dope person. She's a hell of a hell of vibe to ride with. I mean, like for real, for real, one of my favorite people to ride with, and I know a decent amount of the group members kind of feel the same way. She is one of a lot of people's favorite people to ride with just because she's really fun. She's always hella hype. Which is what rides need. That's what group rides need is hypeness, is stoke, is um, it's fun. I was talking to the homie last night about like the small town stuff I might run into, like some of the way out in the boonies towns. And one, I'm a little bit nervous, but two, I am a little bit stoked also. Um, I'm really excited to see these very, very, very small towns. You know, like a little, little population 200 town. Um, one of the towns I'm going through in Oklahoma, it's actually, it's where the original, uh, or Dorothy's original house on Wizard of Oz, Wizard of the, yeah, Wizard of Oz? On Wizard of Oz, um, it's from. Wow, I just messed that whole up. That whole line I messed up. Didn't say any of that right. How y'all doing? But yeah, so I'm pretty pumped on that. My freaking speaker died, and that's like the worst. When you're your dive. See how much noise I can get them to make while we're all in the tunnel. Okay. See, that's what's fun about tunnels. But as you guys see, we still got the gang back there behind us. There's seven of us out here on Surons on a Sunday. Seven, sir, on Sunday. Well, wait, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six of us. Oh, man. I've been telling people there's six people behind me and there's really five. So people probably been waiting for that sixth person and that sixth person has never came. Go take them. Let's let's see who has balls. Let's let's take them over here. Let's go pop them down these stairs, guy. Should we go take them down these stairs? <laughs> I just seen them over here. Oh look, charging stations. Good to know. Good to know. Oh wow, those are big stairs. Holy shit. I'm coming back! Yeah, nobody came. Nobody came down the stairs with me, guys. De oh, shit, that would have sucked. Balls. What the fuck? I can't. This is not right. They're probably like, what the fuck happened to Caddy? I got trapped. Oh, so there's a gang. I know I'm always saying you guys don't see anybody because I'm always the one talking to the camera. But see, there is people with me. Security's about to come. Are they? They're right there. We're in trouble. Oh, we're busted. Uh-oh. No. All right, everybody stay oh, here. Shit. I'm just going to run up the hill. Mall cop. Oh, yeah. Hello, Mall cop. Uh-oh. 
Uh, I got this, guys. I got it's this. Like, yeah. Don't worry. Are right, you here for the group ride? Are you here for the group ride? No. Oh. Okay. Oh, well, it's okay. That's probably exactly why she didn't want us here, was because she was scared I was gonna come up in here and just stunt so hard and be so hot and steezy, I was gonna catch the parking lot on fire because my skills are just so hot. I can hold a wheelie now, guys, for like four seconds. Four fucking seconds. That's like four seconds faster than I used to be able to hold a wheelie before. <laughs> I don't know, it may, I, I guess it's just not coming as fast to me as it has to other people, but I will get the hang of it and I will learn how to willy. Mark my words, I will learn how to willy. If I don't know by the time I leave to Austin, I will learn in Austin. 100% guaranteed, if I cannot pop my bike up and hold a willy decently by the time I leave Austin, I will completely quit riding Surong. No, I won't. But it sounded good, huh? That's how determined I am. Bad rolling. Look at her bike, looks so <laughs> sick. Yeah, that's, yeah, you're right. But totally, I would recommend. We are really out here. We are really out here today. We are biking it. We had no choice but to get on the regular road. Um, but yeah, it's okay. We're not doing it for too long. We are pulling some, I guess this would be borderline illegal shit. But it's nothing too bad. Just that part right there. It's been such a good ride so far today. Um, it really, really brings me a bunch of joy to know that we can get a pack together like this on a short notice. Um, for our first Sir on Sunday ride. Wow. wow. That car is sick. But yeah, it makes me really happy that we get six, seven bikes together for the first Sir on Sunday ride. Those are only Sir ons. Um, usually we have more bikes with us on the other rides, but. I think Sundays are a bit hard for our group to make it out to. I've noticed that I think weeknights are a little bit easier for our group. Um, not sure why, I'm gonna have to find out. We're about to do a ride called Intro to Group Rides here on Wednesday, and that's basically gonna be like an introduction to riding with a group, to riding with our group, what our hand signals mean. Um, it's gonna be a really good ride for beginners to get out to. I suggest anybody that's running group rides in their city definitely set up something similar to intro to group rides for your riders just so they understand why we're not hauling ass all the time. Um, when is a good time to haul ass? What rides to go to? What, what everything down to? What the person in the back is doing? Oh, that got rough. Oh. Chrissy's back there not even giving a shit. It's funny, my group, the group's always asking how I know which way to take them on all the rides. Cause I lead a majority of our rides. I'd say about 95% of charged group rides. Um, I'm the one leading the ride. So they always wanna know how I know where I'm going and how I know all these random little spots it's because i ride so much during the week looking for different routes and just because i like to ride that i end up finding a bunch of really cool fun stuff for the group right here right now none of them probably have any idea that this part exists they're gonna be like what that was so cool oh look Nobody really knows about this. Colorado Springs locals, check this out. Right here is a secret entrance to this back section and this back section. 
is pretty cool. Hold on. It's not right. Again, good thing this is a sirloin ride. But yeah, so we're at a lake. Where'd everybody go? What happened? Dude just went cruising that way. All right, we got the group back together, guys. Now we're back. Losing people on group rides is a real thing. Um, and that just goes to show it doesn't, it's not necessarily always speed involved. It's, um, like he said, these grasses get way tall. So it gets really hard out here to keep everyone together. This is why on rides like this, I do specify this was a Suron only ride or Talarias or basically electric dirt bikes or electric bikes that can handle anything really because you don't know what you're gonna come across when we're on these trails. Like you've seen, we have went from literally riding on the main road to now circling a lake going through all that mud. We went upstairs, downstairs today. I think we've done just about every kind of riding style there possibly is. So I don't know many other things that could do everything that we've done on this ride today. Uh, some EUCs could handle it for sure, but we've ran into spots before that the EUCs have had problems as far as the off-road capabilities go i'm not saying anything bad about eucs or anything like that so don't take it wrong guys whoa yeah whoa oh shit are you okay Take your time, wait, get his feet. I got it. I'm good. Turn in. Good. Good. Oh, oh shit. So yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure if my frame rate stopped my GoPro from recording or if it got too hot a little bit ago or what it was. But it was not recording for a majority of this ride. Idiots. But yeah, we're about wrapping up now with Sir on Sunday. Thank you to everybody who came out for Sir on Sunday. Big shouts to all of you guys for watching this video. And my next video I'm planning on posting is I don't know. It will be a surprise. No, so what's coming up next is I'm hoping this battery comes in from Motoclops. This next week, we have three weeks until I leave to Austin, ladies and gentlemen. Three weeks, and that is not that long. Of course I didn't get the outro done yesterday, because my freaking battery died. Come on, GoPro, give us a battery already that lasts. But anyways, I want to thank every single one of y'all. Like I say always, you and you and you and you in the back for watching the video, watching it all the way through. Make sure to hit that like and subscribe button. We got this Texas ride in exactly three weeks. Three weeks away. Woo! Much love to all y'all and until next time, peace.